Welcome to Sources and Starbreeze on TikTok and social media. Today is January 24th, 2024, and it is Galactic Activation Portal Day on the Dream Spell calendar. These are high vibing, high energy, galactic portal, interdimensional portals that open up and are more easily accessible. So let's look at the calendar for today. Yellow Overtone Warrior. I empower in order to question, commanding fearlessness. I seal the output of intelligence with an overtone tone of radiance. I am guided by the power of flowering. I'm a galactic activation portal. Enter me. Keywords for the overtone tone are commanding, radiance, and empower. The Yellow Warrior. Questions, fearlessness, and intelligence. Yellow warriors are trustworthy, realistic, wise, mystical, graceful, receptive transmitter, divine communicator, deep status conscious, high standards, and pragmatic. Today is also the day before the full moon, so I mean, I changed up, uh, but it's already at 100%. You can see that uh, at 100% already. And it will be in Cancer. So I decided to change it up. I'm going to do the Lightworker Oracle. This is the first uh, book I ever, and cards I ever got. Like seven years ago, I've been studying Oracle and Tarot. I didn't know the difference between the two. But um, no idea. <laughs> so let's get some positive messages for this portal today. I'll just choose one card and read it to you. I don't know if I'll read the whole thing. Yeah, I guess I will. If you're a light worker like me, this is for you. The free for the warrior. The warrior. Spiritual warrior. Grounding. So that's an earth element. Um, this is about service. So you need to ground yourself before you serve others. Um, creating positive changes in your life by the choices you make with courage and strength. So let me see what it says in the book. Okay. You long for the free and open worlds of spirit and light, yet also learn or yearn to experience the healing power and divine joy of sacred sound and living color. You are meant to bring joy, beauty, and comfort to this world to share the spiritual light. To do so, you need grounding. Your dreams want you just as much as you want them. Grounding helps you bring your dreams to life in your world for the benefit of many. When a reminder comes from higher guidance to ground oneself is a loving encouragement, never a judgment. Grounding is a spiritual version of remembering to call your mother. It is a chance to check in with what is happening in your physical life and make sure you are giving appropriate time and energy to what really matters to your heart. It is a chance to appreciate the beauty of the natural world and the love in your relationships. It is a chance to make sure your spiritual work is being applied in your life in ways that feel good for you. It is a chance to speak your prayers rather than only think them. You might even dance with them or create colorful flower offering for your altar or sing them from your heart. We are guided to ground ourselves when there has been an increase of light to the head. This can occur through meditation, prayer, or conscious connection with the spirit. You might be on fire with ideas and inspiration, but struggling to express them practically. You may even feel congested or tense in parts of your body where the energy needs some help to flow. This is a sign to move in a way that feels free, strengthening and expressive, and to add healthy relaxation and exercise into your lifestyle to allow for healing to occur. When the light can move through your entire body, bringing vitality and helping you translate your ideas into your reality. To do so, take care of your body. Be sure you get to get plenty of hydration and rest. Spend time in nature. Use salt baths to cleanse your energy. Eat foods that strengthen and nourish you. Ground yourself by releasing emotional content if you are either swinging from one extreme to another or retreating to your head to analyze rather than to express. You can ground emotional energy by writing in a journal or creating art, poetry, 
music, or dance to express your feelings. You can also ground emotional energy through physical exercise or being in nature. Practice soothing and calming yourself so that you can return yourself to a contented practice soothing and calming yourself so that you can return yourself to a contented contented trusting and peaceful state of being this can be done by talking to yourself in a gentle loving encouraging voice reassuring yourself that everything is working out according to a higher plan and that you are very loved guided meditations and relaxations that help you feel connected peaceful and loved will also be helpful choose what works for you You'll know when you are grounded because you will feel very connected to your body, aware of your emotions, and clear, energized, and present with a sense of well-being. If you are not feeling that way, this oracle says that you can. Your energy and well-being can improve, and you can feel good about who you are and how you choose to live your life. Grounding will help you and help the universe to help you. Okay, this is the invocation, invocation it says to say. I call upon the loving gene genius of the divine and my own spirit please help me now through unconditional love and divine mercy to ground all levels of my being so i can manifest my highest and most loving lovingly joyful destiny now i enjoy being present in the here and now with my body and my breath receiving spiritual light and shining it through my heart into the world i love my body and my senses my soul and my heart they are all venues for my spirit to experience and express in this world for the greatest good May all living beings feel helpful grounding through unconditional love for the highest good. Through my own free will, so be it. And I'll show you the invocation. If you want to, you can... Oh, I don't know if that's blurry or not. It looks kind of blurry. But if you can, you can screenshot that and maybe say that. So definite grounding. Let's look back at the calendar. Yeah, flowering. So that would have to do oh that would have to do with grounding. Trustworthy, realistic, wise, mystical, graceful, receptive transmitter, divine communicator. So in order to communicate with the divine, grounding needs to be, take place. So you can um start from the ground up through your chakras. Going from this chakra all the way up to the top. And the beginning of that is your root chakra. So maybe go out in nature if you can or if you have today. That will help with your soul purpose and with the dream spell portal calendar today. Okay, tomorrow's a double day, so I'll be back for that. And I will have another um, Oracle reading. Thanks for watching. Peace, love, and light.